Hello reformers and welcome back to Shadow of War. Now when we left off we were kind of chasing a particular Nazgul all over the place. Eltariel was kind enough to help us in the previous episode and basically prevented the Nazgul from absorbing our essence. But now we have something else to do which is tracking down Helm Hammerhand to the snowy peaks of Saragos. Let us join Eltariel and defeat him. I'm making a habit of saving you. I think I prefer the version where you don't impale me. Where is the Nazgul? Nearby. Can you keep up? I'll do my best. That was not the first time for you to face Helm, was it? I've faced each Ringwraith more times than I can count. And you've never defeated them? Not yet. Then why do you keep fighting? In the war against darkness, sometimes stalemate is victory. From now, the battle must be won. All right, so apparently that is the Nazgul's Drake. Well, that's interesting. So can I shoot this and maybe shadow mount it or something? I mean, that might make some sense. Ah, oh, no, 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 ah, oh, wait, wait, no, wait a minute. Wait, wait a minute. Is that not? Ah, oh, can I not shadow mount that? Why isn't it broken yet? Is that? Oh, no, that is actually the Nazgul's Drake. Oh, well, that's hilarious in itself. Okay. Well, that was easy enough. Of all Helm's servants, the Drakes are most dangerous. If we could dominate one, we could turn the weapon of the enemy against him. Like a ring of power. You do nothing to dispel my fears, Elf Lord. Hmm, yes, exactly. Yeah, Keller Brimbord does say some rather ominous things, I've got to say. Oh well, let's hope that he's... Still going to stay on our side for the foreseeable future. But we killed the Drake pretty easily. Oh, okay. Uh, never mind. I was just like, yes, we killed the Drake pretty easily, and now there's more of them. Of course. Of course there is. Okay, so this is going to be... Ow! Okay, yeah, this is, this is going to be ow. Okay, so let's try and do a little bit of damage with maybe Elven Light. Yeah, that's not good. I have the Flame Elven Light on still. Okay. So it seems like we might have to change that around a little bit. Yes. Poison. There we go. Okay, so now hopefully I'll be able to maybe do some damage. There we go. Just daze it a little bit. That's all I got to do. Just daze it a little bit. Okay, now just get out the way. There we are. Oh, that one's that one's almost dead. That one's really, really close to dying. Oh, no, no. You can't go anywhere. Or maybe you can because I'm being attacked by Karagors and all kinds of things. All kinds of beasties want to kill me. Well, that's, that's nothing new, I suppose. All right, so let's just wait for my focus to come back a little bit. It's going to take a bit of time. There we go. One is already down. Eltario always does a massive amount of damage anyway. So she probably doesn't even need our assistance. A little bit more. There we go. Ah. Almost. Almost. Okay, let's get out of the way of that. Thank you very much. Oh, and there you go. Nice. Okay. Their spirit endures. It returns to Barad-dûr, growing in strength until it can again take physical form. So, they are banished from death. An elf assassin. Yes, very similar to you, Talion. Very similar to you. I, I can assume that he's he's got some pity for them. I mean, you, you you know, you would have pity for them, considering what has been done to them, corrupted and so on. My master commands that you serve him, but your she-elf friend, I will take her head and hands as trophies. 
What? A Nazgul taking trophies? Oh, come on now. I think that's a bit much, isn't it? I don't know. Okay, well, let's just let's just get her up as quickly as we can. No, 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 no. Come on now. Are you serious? Am I going to seriously die? Well, I'm seriously dying here. Well, this is interesting. Very interesting in actual fact. I was thinking to myself, huh, what's going on with her? Why is she dying so easily? Ow. Okay. Let's see whether I can actually survive this. I'm actually unsure what I'm supposed. Oh, I'm dead. Yes. Okay, so that, f that threw me for a loop pretty badly, actually. You could already see that I was a, a little bit off kilter there because I was thinking to myself, why does she get killed instantly? Am I supposed to do the fight without her? Maybe that's it. Or maybe it's just a bit unlucky. That's probably it. That is probably it. Anyway, let's try again. We've got this. We've got this. It's, it's not even a difficult fight. It's just the fact that I got a, uh, you know, I got caught a bit off guard there for a second. And obviously the drakes are making things quite difficult in itself anyway. So, yes, I understand. Yes, you 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 have a thing for hands and for heads. So let's let's just you know get on with things, shall we? All right. So now he's gonna bring me over. Okay. So he's gonna call me. Now here's the thing. I don't exactly... Yeah, look at that. Now, what, what, what is he going to do? Is he going to do something to uh, Eltario again? or I, I actually don't know. He seems to be zipping around quite a bit. Should we kill the Drakes first, or shall we just kill him? That's the thing. I, I would assume that killing him would be the best idea, because the Drakes are going to take quite a lot of my concentration, shall we say. And that's never a good idea, is it? It's never a good idea to divert your attention so dramatically but maybe it would be an idea I don't know I mean he's going to attack me isn't he okay doesn't seem like it I don't really want Eltariel to get killed again either because that was the main thing that actually caused us to lose in the first place before anyway ow okay let's be a bit, bit careful here Okay, so he's got some really cool attacks, i got to say. He's very fast, very nimble, and he's able to do things that you wouldn't necessarily think. Oh, no, no, okay, apparently he's immune to that. Not immune to that, though. Arrow in the face. Spirit arrow in the face, shall we say. Okay, I'm a bit worried about the drakes, to be honest. Shall I, shall I just go close again, try and do some damage? Going close does not seem to be a very good idea. Because then he just comes at you with those unblockable, uninterruptible attacks, which I've got to say are quite annoying. Okay, he wow, he's actually dying pretty nicely. Altario is doing a lot of damage to him, i got to say. Okay, so now he's doing these unblockables. Can't do anything about that, so I've just got to dodge as best as I can. Not much more I can do, to be honest. Uh, maybe we can shoot him a little bit? Yes! Yes, good damage. Good damage. Okay, let's see, just continue to dodge a little bit. And have you noticed how even though I'm using focus and using my slow motion abilities, it is not making any difference to his speed, which is kind of amazing in itself. He is seemingly immune to that. Perhaps. Ow. Okay, is he dead soon? He's almost down. He is almost down. We need to get... Oh, there, we, there we go. He's broken. But the Drake is now being kind of annoying, and he's going on one of his unblockable attacking sprees once again. So once he's done with this, I should be okay to go in and dominate. Like now. You should have given me your daughter's hand when I asked.
for your daughter's safe return. Please, don't fight him. If you kill me, you'll start a war. War has come! You stood beside Sauron as he gave these kings the very rings that doomed them! Those rings were meant to bring order. Sauron deceived me. He deceived us all. Knowing what you know now, still, you crafted a new ring. <laughs> he crafted a ring. I asked that you pick up my hammer. It is not noble men we are dominating, but savage orcs. And it is with this army that all Sauron has wrought will be un- Done. No matter the cost. A drake would have been a great asset. Well, it looks like all of the kings and all of the ringwraiths, as a result, have extremely tragic stories. I mean, you saw it for yourself, right? Okay, so yeah, apparently Talon, Talon doesn't want to say anything about that, and Altario is still, <laughs> is still on the map, as you can see. She's still fighting away over there. Oh, never mind, she's disappeared now. Apparently. There was some weird thing going on. Alright, so we still have a bunch of the tribal showdown things to do, but I think it is now about time that we finally dealt with Zog. And Zog is the only, I think, I think basically the only thing left. I mean, you can see here we have 11% left. Pretty sure that's the only thing left. And then we have something in Gorgoroth to do. And Eltario has tracked another Nazgul to these haunted ruins. Find out what they are up to and put a stop to it. But again, as I've said, I think it's probably a good idea to travel to the last remaining Army of the Dead Kanan quest. Because we have a little helper over there. We have Nakra. And he is going to be helping us with this quest. Because beforehand, didn't really have a very good time of things. Actually, not a, not a good time at all. We actually died a lot. But now... Maybe that's going to change. So, I guess I'll see you there. There's also a Celebrimbor activity that we might like to do. Alright, so here we go. This is the final demise of Zog. Or at least I can only hope that it is the final demise. And we have to apparently watch this cutscene once again. Alright, so it would probably be a good idea just to start from, uh, well, zero, and I'm going to be summoning Nakra in here. I've also re-selected my Graug, so I'm using that instead of the Drake for this, because it kind of doesn't really make too much sense to have a Drake 
running around here, I think a Growl would be a little bit more useful, I suppose. But I guess we'll see whether that is indeed the case. Just going to try and eliminate these as quickly as possible. Nakro is obviously going to be an absolutely fantastic addition to the, you know, to the helping. So hopefully that's going to happen. And I don't mean to hurt you, Nakra. Terribly sorry about that. And that fellow's now been enraged, which is not very good. He's enraged by Frost. Okay. Right. Might be a bit of... Uh, might be a bit problematic. But Nakra is... Well, Nakra. I mean, there's not, there's not much I can really say, is there? Apart from the fact that Nakra is just an absolute beast and nothing much can stop him. Uh, at least we've done that. That's the first of many. Oh, and they're not very good. Ah, uh, yes, they're not affected by poison, are they? Yes. Great. Okay, well, they're all dead. And did he already kill the captain? He's already killed the captain. You're amazing. You are absolutely amazing. Uh, he's just like, yes, I know. He doesn't even have to say anything. He's just, yes. Yes, I know. And, okay, so let's go back to the fire there, and, yeah, I think that's good. Okay. Alright, there is actually a gem over here that I might like to pick up. There we go. And now we just deal with Luga, who's that fellow. You know, remember that fellow that we shamed down to level one? So, yes, he's, uh, he's here again. And he's almost dead. As you can see, he's very easy to kill. But, yeah, I, I gotta say, I'm not a big fan of the addition of them speaking in undead tongue, or whatever that may be. I find that a little bit... Eh, you know? It's, it's not really very impressive to me, because I would much rather have them just not say anything. But maybe that's just me. There we go. Okay, so let's let's try and do that. Come, uh, ah, okay, let's try and do that. Oh, that was close. That was really close. Nakra, where are you? Oh, there he is. <laughs> he was like, oh, I was on the top. I was on the top not doing much. No, now he's come down at least. Okay, so let's go up and go around. I'm, as you can see, I'm just working my way around here. And who's the next guy? Now, this is a fellow that we haven't fought yet. Oh, yes, we have. We did fight this guy. Okay. So, yeah, let's just do some damage to him, I guess, and just kill some of the ranged units. And, of course, he's going to speak to us once again. Marku the Raven. Yes, stay away from me, please. Please do not speak to me. For too long, at least. Okay, can I do some damage? There we go. Okay, so Nakro is just going to distract them. And I'm going to try and dom dominate, purify, whatever it is. There we go. And then we can just eliminate everyone in this area. And maybe... A oh, he's immune to executions. Okay, he's immune to executions. I guess I should just literally just let Nakro do his thing. Because he is murdering all of them and he's just like Ugh, this is this is kind of boring <laughs> he's uh maybe maybe he is having fun actually because he just beheaded that guy so maybe it is maybe it is kind of fun for him okay so this is going to be quite difficult this particular part because well it's kind of obvious right i mean we have three totems four captains and zog himself is also here so this is going to be a bit difficult. I wonder whether Nakra is going to catch me up. Can you can you just transport over here easily, or no? He's just going to run all the way around. Where? where, where? Oh yeah, he's whoa, whoa. Okay, he, he's got to get places. He's got to get places. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to do this, and I'm going to. Oh yeah, I didn't want to really do that. Uh, okay, that doesn't seem to have worked out, and this is not going to work either. Okay, Nakra. Uh, okay. Uh, I think Zog is, is talking to me, but this guy also decided to talk at the same time. So, that's kind of amusing. Okay, you could stop now. You could stop now. I get it. I get it. You have very, very spiky things coming out of your head? Is that a helm? Is that a helm or a, or a headpiece? Or I, I don't even know. Is he still talking to me? I... 
Is this a bug? Or... I... I, I don't know. Because... Okay, you're, you're finally done. Okay, phew. That was close. I was literally thinking to myself, oh, I'm gonna have to, you know, restart this entire mission. That would be awful. That would be really bad. Okay, so hopefully Nakra will... Oh, Zog is fighting us. Of course he is. Ah, oh, Nakra's come down. Yes. Nakra has finally come down. This is gonna be easy now. Oh, yes. This is gonna be real easy because Nakra is obviously here. And he is just amazing. So, let's do our elven light at you. Yeah, there we go. I told you when you killed me that I would rise and rise again. But here you are, trying to put an end to me once more, and failing. You are a simple man. Ah, oh, I see. Well, you're dying very, very quickly because you're not paying attention to Nakra. Yes, that is literally what happens when people don't pay attention to Nakra. It's, it's crazy. It's crazy how effective he is. Look at this! He's killed him! He just killed him! He just killed him with a regular, regular attack. He didn't even, he didn't even give him, <laughs> he didn't even give him the benefit of just being like, oh yes, uh, I'm gonna kill you with a really stylish attack. No, he just bopped him on the head a little bit. Did he just get back up? Did Zog literally just get back up? Yes, it appears he did. Okay, I'll do that then. Well, at least Nakra is absolutely murdering them all. And I don't actually need to worry about him at the moment. So I guess I should just go over here, purify this totem. Please, 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 please. Come on, I need to do it. Yeah, there we go. Thankfully, zombies are a little bit slow. So that's... that's helpful. Oh, I did not want to do that. Okay, don't interrupt me. Ah, Zog. Stay away from me, please. Okay, well, seems like Nakra's gonna have some fun time with him again. Okay, I've just gotta... I, I guess what we gotta do is try and lure these guys away from where we currently are, and then that's going to, in turn, make things a little easier, I guess. I suppose so. Okay, there's, there's a, a, a couple of kills there. Okay, I'm just going to try now. Ugh. Okay, fine. Be annoying then, Talion. Just just continue to vault over them and do annoying things that don't make any sense. Yes. Uh, okay, well, do a little bit of damage to this guy. Are the other captains going to get back up? Because it doesn't look like they're going to get back up after we kill them, I think. Because the other guy that we killed, the big guy, he hasn't gotten back up. So I think we're okay. Yes, I understand that, Celebrimbor. I'm attempting to do so. You understand now, don't you? The dead aren't dead. They're just waiting for someone who will listen. Who will answer their call. Once you're out of the way, we will all rise again. I'm going to just take a quick look at his abilities here. He is unbreakable, can never be broken even when at low health. Ah, uh, that's sad. I really wanted to dominate him, but again, he's undead as well, so obviously that makes it kind of difficult. Anyway, destroy Zog once and for all. All of his friends have been eliminated, and oh, I'm terribly sorry, Nakra. I'm really, really, uh, I'm really sorry about that. Okay, I'm also hitting him. I'm just going to heal him. Okay, apparently, does he need healing? And now I've stunned him again. What am I doing? What am I doing to him? I'm so sorry. Terribly sorry. Okay, now I'm just going to heal. Can I not heal him? Oh, I can't heal him. Never mind, he's just going to kill Zog by himself. Yeah, that was that was pretty easy. <laughs> oh, hilariously easy, actually. It is Kana. I told you, Ranger. Undead 
will defeat undead. Well, there we go. Well, she did tell us. She did tell us that that was going to happen. So that's it. We have finally eliminated Zog. And that is, of course, with the thanks of Nakra, because, well, without him, uh, <laughs> I don't think we would have been able to do anything. All right, so... Ah, I'm not a big fan of this, i got to say. I feel like this arcane rune from Zog is not that good, because 13 focus recovery per kill in comparison to 50% increased damage dealt by Uruk allies, I really don't think that's worth it. So, not going to be... Equipping that. Yes. Interesting. Okay. Anything else? No. Alright, so that is done. We now have an extra skill point. And the only other thing that we can do now is, I guess, go to Gorgoroth. But we'll be doing that in the next episode. I thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next time. <laughs>